So here is another free material library that is available to Blender users. Now this one is from Blender Kit, which is a community driven kind of uploading sharing site, I believe. Um, and all the materials on here are for free. So let's go ahead and check it out and see how you can get access to it. So I'm actually using one of the HDRIs that I've actually uploaded to Blender Kit, but we'll talk about that in a sec. So to enable it, we go edit preferences and we just type in Blender. And here it is up the top, Blender Kit Online Asset Library. Give it a tick, wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. You get a wonderful menu, which I am just in the way. There we go. So from here, we can see that we've got our materials and we can do searches on whatever we want. So we click on ground and then we'll see up the top here, hopefully all those uh, materials will come up. Now, remember you will need to be connected to the internet as this will go up to you know the, the Blender Kit servers to bring back all the information. There we go. So these are all the FX ones that have come up. Let's just go to grass, bring up all the grass ones. And you can see now we've got all the grass textures that are appearing. Um, and we can see who the author is down there. Beautiful. So let's just click on one of them. Probably should do it on a grass. You'll see that it's going to download. This is a bit of a big one, 88 meg. Um, it would be nice if we could see the sizes before we download them, but that's fine. This is just something else. And so we actually a really pretty big list here, but this is not the only thing that it has. We'll just do one more quick search um, so we can see what the grass looks like. Oh, it looks like a soccer pitch. That's not too bad. Let's go over to rock. Let's wait for the rock ones to come up. And we can see that now we've already got a whole bunch of rocks that we can use. Hey, look, this looks like the texture from um, Vanguard, Valheim. I'm intrigued to see what this one looks like. And so, yeah, that's not too bad. So I'm currently using cycles to peg through this, peg through it. If we go into EV, let's just have a quick wait. Materials don't look too bad either. So it's all hunky dory. Now the other features this has is if we click on models. Now I've bought the full plan to support this. Um, if you want to go down to the description, there is a link if you want to use that. If not, that's fine. And we've got a whole bunch of assets we can use. So there's 346 architectural stuff, but we can expand it and it's all in its little folders as well. So there's quite a few models in here that we can use. And let's just go, yeah, unpacking, downloading that file. GZ, where are you? There you are. And what's that? That's a beautiful window. Ooh, I'm intrigued what this bridge looks like. <sighs> now you have to remember only some of the models are for free. Um, but like I said, I've already bought the full plan because great success, success. The scenes, obviously we can download some scenes. There's not a lot in here at the moment but we've got a lot of HDRIs. Uh, these are my HDRIs. Now, as I was uploading, I could see that there was about 500 HDRIs, but for some reason, why are they not all coming up? Uh, we can change the, we can set the max res and so on and so forth. Um, let's just do outdoor and then we'll change. Ooh, in a cave, ooh, nice. Let's do a 4K one and there we have it. Oh, wow. That's pretty cool. That's a cool HDRI. So yeah, there's a massive list on there. Um, that's pretty much about it. Um, we, there are brushes as well uh, for sculpting, but I don't do sculpting because I have no intention of sculpting, but I probably should learn it, but I haven't. If you found this video helpful in any manner, absolutely any, give me a like, hit the subscribe. Um, Cause if you want me to keep finding free content, let me know. And I'll know by you button.